Hey guys, we're out here in the good old Arizona desert again, and we're going to be looking for some runes. I visited this spot about a year ago, and I thought it'd be a great idea to do a follow-up video on this one. The weather outside is absolutely beautiful today, and we've got some ground to cover, so let's head out. We're not even close to the ruins yet, but we've already found our first pottery shirt out here. Look at that beauty. That is so cool. We're just gonna leave that there though and keep on going. Oh, you're always bound to stumble into some beautiful rocks out here. Just check these beauties out. But we've got a destination that we've got to get to, so we're just gonna say hi to these guys move on. Hmm, I don't remember ever seeing that rock formation over there. Where there's red, there's a good chance there's iron in those rocks. And there might be some clay. So that's definitely going to be worth checking out in a little bit. There's our destination off there in the distance. Isn't that just beautiful? We've got so much rain this year, it's pretty wild. This spring is sure to be one green one. But it'll be a real concern for wildfire season though when it starts to dry out. And this particular area got hit by a really bad wildfire a few years back. It sure has been making some rather nice recovery since. It's always such a fun area to hike around and explore. There's no trails out here, just beautiful terrain for miles. Heading up this side here will bring us to the top of that first hill. We'll follow the saddle of the mountain on in. We're almost there, just a little bit further up to the top. Man, these views already sure are crazy. Oh, we got some sprinkles now. I don't know what I'm more excited about. This rain or getting up to the top of this hill. Whoa, look at all that rain dumping off in the distance. That is just so amazing. Wow. Well guys, we finally made it up to the top of this hill. I've got the ruins right over there, but we're going to take a quick pit stop right here because check out that beautiful view behind me. Oh man, it doesn't get much better than that, does it? I've got drizzles coming down too. Oh. I am so excited. So I'm gonna run that quick time lapse real quick and then we'll shoot up over the ruins in that direction there. Well, that was just incredible now, wasn't it? But now I think it's time to check out those ruins. We got a pottery shirt here. That looks like a really beautiful color. Let's see what it can tell us. Hmm, just looking at the weird angle here. This looks like it might have been the neck of something. We'll just leave it right where we found it. Right next to the, um, broken glass that somehow got up here. Well, up here on this mountain you can see lots of signs of activity. This is always the site of Arizona highways. They never share with you. All these bullet casings all around. Oh boy. 
All right, guys, we're about to head over to the ruins over here. But as a reminder, anytime you're exploring ruins like this, always leave everything the way you see it so that the generations to come can enjoy these wonderful sights. We're looking at a crumbled wall that surrounds the rooms. There's about six rooms in the lower part of these ruins. You'll always find a lot of out of place rocks around here. They might have been chippings from some tools being made. But this definitely wasn't formed at the top of this mountain though. There's a lot of rocks that have crumbled apart over the years. Speaking of out of place rocks earlier, check out this massive chunk of caliche. I just wonder what it could have been used for. The imagination sure can run wild. Well, it looks like someone traveled here before and left a bunch of sherds on this rock. Hmm, we might as well take a look at them as long as they're here. Oh, this one's nice and smooth. Oh wow, this is really smudged on the inside. That is really black. Now well, we got some more planeware over here. This is cool. So on the lower level of these ruins, this is one of the more well-preserved rooms around. You can just see the wall structure right here. That is just incredible. Can you just imagine the amount of time that went into building these structures? These rocks are really quite heavy. Here's a better angle of the lower ruins. Oh, just incredible. Well, it looks like we got some more rain possibly heading this way. So let's go take a look at the upper ruins and see what kind of amazing views we can see. Wow, this is incredible. There's just so much to take in right now. Well, we made it guys, we're up at the top of these rooms. Let's go check them out in more detail. But first, I gotta take a quick time up to this cloud behind me. Well, you can tell it's rained quite a bit around here recently. Got that mortar hole right here. Looks like somebody left some shirts that they found around here too. Look at that beautiful rim. What a neat color too. Look at this big piece. Oh, this is a neat piece. Oh, wow. This is really a neat piece. Let me see if I can zoom in for you guys. My goodness, it's so smooth. Wow. This was some skill right here on this one. I'm really impressed. You usually don't find shirts this thin. This is cool.
Hmm. I suspect this part of the room collapsed. It's right up on the edge of this cliff. There's nothing left of the wall. It's just a straight drop down. Ugh. Oh, I fear something tragic must have happened a long time ago over here. Ooh, here's another interesting piece. It has a bit of a fire cloud on this one. Just beautiful, isn't it? Here's some more ruins on the edge of the mountain here. Boy, they sure had a spectacular view, didn't they? Wow. Oh man, things are about to get really interesting around here. Look at that. Well, I just live for these kind of storms. Isn't this just beautiful? Wow. Oh man, this is so cool. Just amazing. Well, it got cold super quick out here. Just check that out. That is incredible. That almost looks like snow on the mountain. Whoa. Well, here's a sight you don't see too often. Snow in the Sonoran Desert. Oh man, this is just incredible. Well, this sure was an incredible day. I'm so glad I could share this with you guys. I really hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Till next time, my friends.